Hello everyone, welcome to this tutorial. Today we're going to be learning how to add luminance to materials uh, in Cinema 4D of the physical and standard render engines. So I've set up a scene right now. Um, as you can see, it's similar to my how to render a build tutorial video. Uh, everything is relatively the same. I have a single sky and since I have global illumination, if I render this, you can see the scene is going to be slightly eliminated, right? Okay, so what we're going to want to do is make light uh, be emitted from the sea lanterns here and the end rods here. I've already separated the materials and put them on the top, so here. Um, and I'm going to select both of them. And luminance is created with the luminance channel, so take this and go to the luminance tab. Right, um, here you can either select the texture to make the luminance uh, be created by that texture or select the color. Um, so for the end rod, I'm just selecting the end rod. I'm gonna want uh, an orange, so something like this, maybe lighter like this. And the brightness is gonna determine how strong the emission is gonna be. So let's try 150, all right. And for the sea lantern, I'm gonna try a texture. So you click on the three dots here. I'm gonna look for sea lantern, this one, right? Uh, sampling should be a none. Um, and if I render this now, you'll see the emissions really don't look that great. If I let this render for a while more, uh, we'll, you'll start to see more um, inconsistencies in the illumination like here you can see some kind of blotchy surfaces uh, to fix this you just select both of the materials that have emission go to the illumination tab you take gi area light and if i render just the region we saw earlier we'll see there we go there's no more issues all right now our issue with this is how do you control it? How do you make it uh, emit more light? And that is why we have the illumination tab. Um, so I'm gonna select the sea lantern, for example. So my lamppost. And I want it to emit light all over here. I can just go to generate GI strength and put this up. So let's try 800 and render it. And now you see there's way more illumination coming from the from the lamp and it's even this one is illuminating the whole surface of the house all right now for the end rod um go to the illumination tab as well uh generate gi let's do 500 i don't want it to emit as much light and uh saturation is going to determine how the the illumination itself is saturated so if, if I put this to zero you will see the end rods themselves are very uh, colorful and bright but the um, light emitted is completely white so if I put this to 500 it's the opposite effect androids are the same color but the light uh, emitted is very very saturated another side note is as you can see the sea lantern has the texture uh, but since it's kind of a white texture it's not very colorful the emission to do this uh, to fix this you can either change the texture itself so go in Photoshop and uh, saturate it more or you can do something I do uh, go to mix strength, lower it by one or two percent, select the color, so let's try this, and actually lower it a bit more, and you can see the texture starts being colored by the, the color, and if you render it again, you see the light emitted is now way more colorful. And that's it, that's all you need to do. Thank you for following this tutorial, I hope you enjoyed. Uh, there will be more coming in the future. See ya!